Hey, what's up YouTube and anyone watching there? Alright guys, I'm, today I'm going to show you how to make a screen capturing program. It's not really a screen capturing program, it just takes the screenshot of your entire screen. And I'm going to provide all the codes in the description so that you don't have to watch the video again and again. Alright, let's see what we got in our form over here. We got one picture box, which is called picture box 1. Two buttons button 2, button 1, one timer whose interval is set to 9 seconds and in picture box I will really say click on this little arrow and then go to size mode and choose stretch image it will stretch the image in into entire picture box alright um, let's go to the coding let's go to button 2 which is the capture button me dot opacity equals zero timer one dot enable equals true timer one tick then bounds as rectangle then screenshot as system dot drawing dot bitmap then graph as graphics bounds equals screen dot primary screen dot bounds screenshot equals new system dot drawing dot bitmap bounce dot width bounce dot height system dot drawing dot imaging dot pixel format dot format 32 g b p p a r g b i got no idea about it graph equals graphics dot form image screenshot graph dot copy from screen bounce dot x bounce dot y zero zero bounce dot size copy pixel operation dot source copy picture box one dot image equals screenshot Timer one dot enable equals false. Me dot opacity equals hundred. So what it basically does, it it gets the whole resolution of your screen, and then it takes a screenshot, and then you go to button one, which is the save button. It go dim save file dialog one as new save file dialog. Now you don't really need this line of code, because you can go to toolbox and select the save file dialog which is over here but I've just done this for video alright try save file dialog one dot title equals save file save file dialog one dot file name equals save as save file dialog one dot filter equals jpeg and star dot jpeg if save file dialog one dot show dialog equals dialog result dot ok then picture box one dot image dot save save file dialog one dot file name system dot drawing dot imaging dot image format dot bmp so it saves in the bmp format but it actually saves in the jpeg format <sighs> alright um catch ex as exception and don't do anything over there so let's debug the program quickly Okay, now the program's running. We're gonna click on capture. See, the, as you can see, the opacity has gone to zero, and in nine seconds, the form will be back with full opacity. And as you can see, it has stretched the image into entire picture box. You can you can resize it to anything you want. And now you got the picture. You can. As you can see it has taken the entire screenshot of, of my screen so you can go and save the image and as you can see it's JPEG in JPEG format you can say like I'll just go and say lol as you can see I've already saved the another image as lol dot jpeg so I'm gonna replace it with this one and it saved successfully Alright, I'm gonna provide all the links in the description for the codes. You don't have to watch the video again and again, as I'm saying this second time. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Please subscribe, guys. Thanks.